Hello everybody, I'm the airplane expert Hideki. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to review an airplane with a cute diecast model. I'd like to introduce the 172 Sepercat Jaguar GR3 RAF16R Scourgeon. RF Cortisho Norfolk 2005 from Kogi. The Sepecat Jaguar is an agro-French jet attack aircraft originally used by the British Royal Air Force and the French Air Force in the close air support and nuclear strike law. It is still in service with the Indian Air Force. It was originally conceived in the 1960s as a jet trainer with a light ground attack capability. The requirement for the aircraft had been changed to include supersonic performance, reconnaissance, and tactical nuclear strike laws. A carrier-based variant was also planned for French Navy service, but this was cancelled in favor of the cheaper Dasso Spell Etanda. The Jagger program began in the early nineteen sixties in response to both a British requirement and a French requirement. The British requirement, Air Staff Target 362, was a request for an advanced supersonic jet trainer to replace the Forland Nat T1 and Hawker Hunter T7. The French requirement, EC-80, Ecole du Combat et d'Apri Tactique, Tactical Combat Support Trainer was a requirement for a cheap subsonic dual role trainer and light attack aircraft to replace the Fuga Magister Rocket T 33 and Dasso Mister 4. In May 1966, the international joint company Sepecat was established and development began. It is a joint venture by Breguet, currently Dassault from France, and BSC, currently BAE Systems, from the United Kingdom. Sepecat is a French acronym from Société Européenne de 
Production de Labion École de Combat et Appli Tactique. Production components would be split between Brigade and BSC, and the aircraft themselves would be assembled on two production lines, one in the UK and one in France. The British Light Strike tactical support divisions were the most demanding designs. It was required to have supersonic performance. Superior avionics, a cutting edge nav attack system of more accuracy and complexity than the French version, moving map display, laser range finder, and magnet target seeker LRMTS. As a result, the initial BR 1 to 1 design needed a thinner wing. We designed First large, a higher rear cockpit, and after burning engines. Finally, the British design departed from the French subsonic Breguet 1 to 1 design to such a degree that it was effectively a new design. A separate partnership was formed between Rolls Royce and Turbo Mecha to develop the Ado Tabfan engine. The first of eight prototypes flew on 8th September 1968, a two seat design fitted with the first production model Ado engine. This aircraft went to supersonic on its third flight, but was lost while landing on 26th March 1970, following an engine fire. The second prototype flew in February 1969. A total of three prototypes flew at the Paris Air Show that year. The first French A prototype. Flew in March 1969. In October, a British S conducted its first flight. A Jaguar M prototype flew in November 1969. This had a string sent airframe, an Arrester Hawk, and a different undercarriage, twin nose wheel and single main wheels. A Jaguar M prototype flew in November 1969. This had a string sent airframe, an a r a s a Hawk, and a different undercarriage, twin nose wheel and single main wheels. After testing in France, it went to RAE at Surrey for carrier warning trials. From their land based catapult, after which, in July 1970, it underwent a series of shipboard trials from the French carrier Cremanceau. But Type M was cancelled by the French government in 1973. The Jaguar is an orthodox single seat, swept wing. Twin engine monoplane design with tall tricycle type with lockable landing gears. In its original configuration, it has a maximum takeoff weight in the 15 ton class with a combat radius and internal fuel of 850 km, 530 mile. Giving the Jaguar a greater operational range 
than competitor aircraft, such as the Mikoyan MiG-27. The aircraft had hard points fitted for an external weapons load of up to 10,000 pounds, 4,500 kilograms. Typical weapon fitted includes the Matwa LR F2 rocket pad, BAP 100mm bombs, Matwa AS 37 anti-radar missiles, AIM-9 sidewinder missiles, and walk-like -like cluster bombs. The RAF Jaguar gained several new weapons during the Gulf War, including CRV-7 high-velocity rockets, and American CBU-87 cluster bombs. Finally, the Jaguar was equipped with either a pair of French Defa cannons or British Aden cannons. Jaguar had an export type called Jaguar International, which has received orders from India, Oman, Nigeria and Ecuador. The Jaguar International has the unusual option of overwing pylons used for short-range air-to-air missiles such as the Matra R550 Magic or the Sidewinder. This option freed up the underwing pylons for other weapons and stores. RAF Jaguars gained overwing pylons in the build-up to Operation Columbia in 1990s, but French Jaguars were not modified. The Sepiket Jaguar is powered by the Rolls Royce Turbomaker Adora Turbofan engine, which was developed in parallel ways, and primarily for the Jaguar. A separate partnership was formed between Rolls Royce and Turbomaker to develop the Adora, a two shaft turbofan engine with afterburner. Twin engines were selected for survivability. Ease of maintenance was a major consideration, an engine change being possible within 30 minutes. For the Jaguars, it needs a low bypass capability of high thrust for takeoff, supersonic flight, and low level dashes. When the first prototype Jaguar flew on 8 September 1968, it was also the first flight for the engine. In its initial development, uh, the Ador engine had complications with the stability of the afterburner system, 
and shift ball testing shows slow throttle response times problematic in the situation of an abort landing. Engine improvements rectified these problems prior to the Jaguar coming into service. In French service, the Jaguars were introduced using the original Mark 101 engine. OLF Jaguars entered service using the Mark 102 engine, mainly featuring better afterburner throttle control over the Mark 101. The RF later had its Jaguars re engined around 1981 with the improved. At lower Mark 104, and again in 1999 with the Mark 106, each providing greater performance. The French Air Force took delivery of the past production Jaguar in 1973, one of an eventual 160 single seat Jaguar A's. For type conversion training, French also took 40 of the two-seat Jaguar E. The last Jaguars in French service were retired in 2005. The RLF accepted delivery of the first of 165 single-seat Jaguar GR1s, the service designation of the Jaguar S, with 54F Scarjon in 1974. These were supplemented by 35 two-seat trainers, the Jaguar T2, previously Jaguar V. The Jaguar S and V had a more comprehensive nav attack systems than the A and E models used by the French Air Force. On 20 December 2007, Jaguar undertook the last British military Jaguar flight. But following their retirement from flying service, many Jaguars continued to serve as grand instructional airframes, most notable at RAF Kazfat, used in the training of RAF fitters. Number 16 Scarjon, nicknamed the Saints, was a flying Scarjon at the Royal Air Force providing Elemental Flying Training EFT with a Globe Tutor T1 from Ralph Wittering. It formed in 1915 at St. Omer to carry out a mixture of offensive patrolling and reconnaissance and was disbanded in 1919 with the end of the First World War. The squadron formed on 1st of April 1924 and again took on a reconnaissance law, which in continuous throughout the Second World War. First of all, the squadron was disbanded and reformed several times and was converted to a bomber squadron. Equipped with the Tornado GR1 from 1984, the squadron took part in the Gulf War in 1990. It was again disbanded in September 1991. On the 1st of November 1991, the squadron reformed at RLF Wasi Mouse as number 16 Reserve Squadron, a reserve squadron and an operational conventional unit 
replacing the taking over the aircraft and weapons of number 226 OCU, training and converting new pilots for the Sepecat Jaguar. Although no longer a frontline operational squadron as a reserve or a shadow squadron, its 12 aircraft were equipped with conventional weapons and 8 WE-177 nuclear weapons for use in the high-intensity European war, and it remained assigned to Sasha for that purpose. In December 2003, the MOD announced with the delivering security in a changing world defense review that RAF Cortisial would close in 2007 and the Jaguar fleet would be retired early. This led to the disbandment of number 16 squadron on the 11th of March 2005 as the Jaguar approached retirement. Number 16 squadron reformed again and took on its current wall on the 1st of October 2008. Today, we looked at 172 Sepecat Jaguar GR3 RAF 16R Scarjum RAF Cortisho Norfolk 2005 from Kogi. My upload videos are available every Thursday. Hope to see you again soon. Subscribe. Break ready now.